so Nick's primary sport is baseball. Um, we had received um, a couple of real good recommendations to Driven from people who had been training previously. He created, uh, he sat down with Nick and, and really tried to learn about what his goals were and what he was trying to accomplish and created a real customized program specific to what his, his specific needs were. Yeah, I've, I've noticed differences this year in his quickness. Um, definitely strength, you know, he's, I think, given his sport, because it's baseball, it's a, it's a heavy emphasis on core and legs. He's somebody, I think, that needs the kind of the structure. So I think that the fact that there, there are great class schedules that are offered here and that he can come here and, and, and be pushed to, to try and constantly um, extend the limits of what he's capable of doing. And I think that he gets that with, uh, you know, with training with Driven and, and Gary. So my name's Matt Ty. I'm the head coach at Randolph Basketball for the, uh, for the varsity program and, and all three levels. Um, you know, the reason I'm here is because uh, Driven and Gary at Driven has done a great job with our team and our program and it really helped change the bodies of some of the kids in the program. Well, the best part is my guys love coming here. And uh, the other thing, too, is it's just the kids are f feel better about themselves. They look stronger on the court. Ty was really focused and dedicated to be playing to play collegiate baseball, and he knows this is the next step to doing that, or another step to get him to where he wants to be. One of the best things about Driven for Tyler is that he's here, and he's focused on a specific workout just for him. Um, he, he warms up and he trains with other athletes, but in, for his actual program, everything is geared towards him and his goals. I remember so vividly waking up on game days. I remember the long nights of practice, the road trips, the double headers. I remember the grind. I remember the injuries. I remember the wins, the losses, and those memories, the good and the bad, is what drove me to create Driven Fitness and Performance. I wanted to get back to 100% for spring and I knew that Driven was going to be that thing that was going to get me where I wanted to be in, in three months. So I feel like I'm in the best shape of my life and I, uh, I'm stronger and I'm faster and more agile than I, I've ever been. I want to came here to Driven because it's my off season. I have a week home and I need a place to work out. And last year I went to a gym and I tried to do it on my own and it did not work very well. I was, didn't come back in the shape that I wanted to. And Driven is a place where I can get one-on-one -on -one attention and get the kind of push that I need from a gym. My daughter is here. Um, she works out three days a week with Gary, and she's been doing absolutely wonderful. Um, she thrives on it, loves coming here. Have my daughter come home and say, you know, Mom, I'm part of the either 200 or 300 club. Um, and I'm like, Britt, what is that? And she would talk about the deadlifting and the sleds. I have torn my ACL twice, and the first time around didn't go well, obviously because I tore it again. Um, so the second time around, I was like really looking for something different. I was like checking out a lot of places, and my brother's friend actually told us that we have to check out this new place, Driven. Um, the guy Gary was great, so I was like, okay, like I'll give it a look. And I came here and found out that Gary had torn his ACL a couple of times, and so like he definitely knew what I was going through. And um, we talked for like a while about like the kind of like workouts and like programs that we would do and like what my goals were. And it really seemed like it would be a good fit. My knee feels like ready and healthy to go back to playing, which is like something that means like so much to me. Like I'm so happy about it, and I know I wouldn't have gotten there without Driven. At Driven. This is anything but a cookie cutter training environment. We believe that each athlete is on a building block process. Each athlete needs to work their way up the ladder. And by creating that comprehensive training environment, you empower them. They now all of a sudden believe that they are capable of anything because all you gotta do is show up, put in the work, and they're gonna continue to get results. Everyone can always get quicker, can always get stronger, and it's my goal to be the quickest and the strongest on the field. Oh,